When we were talking to Ian Jones before and he was uh, commenting on, on the size of the inn and the location of it and got me and John really quite concerned about that we were in the right location or whether the boundaries of the, of the site match the original boundaries. On the, uh, on the sums I did last night I couldn't get it out much over 20, 25 feet, you know, um, oh, okay. 8 metres, which seems incredibly small. Yeah, yeah. John, you know we can't seem to suss out where the, the, the building outline is of the, of the original Ann Jones in. Well, Ian suggested, uh, um, he did some sums yesterday and scaling off, say, the, uh, the size of the, uh, the doorway and extrapolating that across, that the building's a lot smaller than we, um, we automatically assumed. Because on here it looks like it could be about closer to 40 foot across, but here it looks much smaller. A couple of possibilities, either that boundary is wrong, mm -hmm. well that boundary is wrong. Mm -hmm. If that boundary is wrong, then we've got a problem. We could be looking for one a smaller building and we could also be looking in the wrong place. Finding this, this is what we're after, this is brilliant, this is, uh, this look could easily be the, the back wall of the Ann Jones Inn. Yeah, could very well be. Could also be the, uh, the front wall of the uh, Ann Jones's house too, from the way we've got the the plan arranged there. Yeah, from Linton's plan, it's interesting. That, you know, you, you've got to take it as uh, as literal until we work out otherwise. But yeah, it could either be these post holes here could either be either side of the front door of her residence. Yep, very likely. I'm going to go for the, the back door of the inn because I want to find the back door of the inn and and seeing the the, the the position of these holes in relation to the C Street frontage, I think it could easily be the rear door and. Uh, and that could be the bedrooms on either side here. It's given us a fixed position, and from these, we can then work out exactly where, where, we go, where we're going in the future. And um, we don't really need to find the chimneys now to, to work out no. the orientation of the site. No. We've got it with these two post holes, and so this is like a totally crucial uh, piece of evidence.